Good morning everybody. Welcome back to my channel and to another video. Today I'm going to be filming a little Sunday in my life video. Bring you guys through a day. It's actually race morning today. So I'm doing a 10k this morning. It should be pretty fun because I have a couple other friends that are also running it. So it's a really early start. It starts 7am. I've been up since like 5.15. I set my alarm for 5, but I slept 15 minutes through my alarm, which is insane. <laughs> but I'm ready to go now. I haven't had coffee or anything. I'm literally running this basically on empty stomach. I'm just going to have one of these Honey Stinger Energy waffles soon. And that's going to be all I have before I run. I'm actually going to eat it now. So that's like basically an hour before. So I'm going to eat that. I'm drinking some water. And yeah. I'll show you guys my like running outfit before I head out the door, but I'm just wearing the yellow sports bra, black shorts, <laughs> black sunglasses, and I actually put my hair in a bun this time. I feel like it's just a little bit more secure and won't get it as messed up from sweat or anything like that while I'm running. I also need to remember to put my earrings in. I'm missing one. <laughs> but yeah, welcome to the Sunday. We're starting it off on a fun note. I'm not. I don't know if I'm gonna set a PR on this race or not. Honestly, I'm just gonna go on how I'm feeling. I have a really bad blister on my one foot. I've just been feeling not in tip-top preparedness for this. So I'm gonna go in and just like listen to my body and just have fun, I'm not making myself set a PR or anything like that. So anyways, it should be fun. Let's go. How do I film if I wanted to? Um, this thing, so you just go like this. Race oh. ready. Here's my race fit. I'm just wearing fast and free shorts from Lululemon. Lemon. My New Balance shoes, the sports bra from Lululemon. Lemon, sunnies, headphones, spy bow. We're ready to rock and roll. <laughs> it's Joe's vlog. <laughs> shoe pig, shoe pig. Okay, Chauncey is gone. Time for me to take over. Um, have my coffee. We're gonna go and watch her finish. I'm currently bending down because Chauncey's much smaller than me. I can have the camera in this position. Skincare for me. Stole this on Chelsea. Benefits, I don't know, but it feels nice on my face. So I do way too many sprays and absolutely soak my face. Again, does it do anything? I don't know. And then I finish it off with this. Um, there we go. Does this do anything? Again, I don't know. Benefits? I don't know. Does it feel nice on my skin? Yes. So, don't know what it does, but it just feels nice. Let's go. Spot Chelsea in a crowd. I'll bring you along with me. And, we got this little princess. You wanna go outside? You wanna go outside? Let's go! Right. I know Chelsea does this. So I'll do it too. Outfit. Hollister. Hollister. Anyone out there? Any male audience? Or anyone looking out for presents for their boyfriends? If you didn't know, Hollister is now the cheaper but just as good alternative as Amber Combi, in my opinion. So yeah, I would recommend check out Hollister first before you buy Amber Combi stuff. Cause, just as good quality, just as nice, and probably half the price. Isn't that right Mills? Let's go. Right, update. Millie has decided to get explosive diarrhea, and I have run out of bags. So, let's hope she doesn't shit on the finish line. Isn't that right Millie? You demon? Let's go! Yeah. 
Let's go, Joe! Right next to Simpkins, of course, check in Trio in support of Simpkins. Let's go, Chad! Let's go! Oh, hey, man, they're going fast and furious here in the Texas Trio in support of Simpkins. Toronto, here he is, bringing it home. That's Teresa Chung. Here we go, Chad. Let's go, Chad. Let's go, Chad. Let's go, Chad. Hello, everyone. Why is it so bright? There we go. I'm back, I'm fresh, we did the 10K. I set a PR, which I'm really happy about. I'll put my stats here, but I'm very, very happy. Wasn't expecting to set a PR, to be honest, but we did, so great start to the day. Now we're just about to go get out and about for a bit in the heat before it downpours. And yeah, thank you to Jay for filming some clips for me. I haven't even watched them yet, but I know we filmed a little montage that I haven't seen, so I can't wait to edit that and see it, but yeah, I'm really happy. I'm honestly shocked. I didn't push myself like to my hardest, I feel like, during the race because I really didn't want to hurt my knee or just get injured, so I kind of just kept a fast pace that I feel like I could with like hold the entire time instead of like pushing to the limit, so I actually managed to cross the finish line for the first time without feeling like I was going to vomit, so... 10 out of 10 for that. Also, my hair is so crazy right now, but anyways, that's my update, feeling good. Hello, everybody. It is the next day. I hope you guys are all doing amazing. It is Monday. We literally leave for Ireland tomorrow. <laughs> so the packing is gonna be in full force today. I'm basically done packing i feel like and everything that i need to do but there's just some like final things i need to wrap up so i need to get this video done and scheduled so that that's ahead of the curve uh, i need to do some invoicing still finish packing so i have the big suitcase laid on the floor there as you can see it's mainly empty on that side which is good because we wanted to keep that one pretty empty in case we want to buy anything We're probably gonna buy some like irish snacks and treats and stuff to bring back with us it's around 2 p.m right now i have a call in a bit with Lu with lululemon which i'm really excited about pretty sure we're going to be continuing our um working together which i can't wait to keep working with them because you guys know i love lulu so i'm very excited to have that call so we're basically bringing a large suitcase which is on the floor and then me and Jay are each bringing a carry-on in a backpack each because you get a personal item and a carry-on bag for these flights. So the carry-on bag that I have has basically all my clothes in it. I have no other things in it, it's just my clothes. So my clothes are all almost basically in that carry-on bag. I also fit like one extra pair of shoes in there, I believe. And then I still need to pack my backpack, which I don't know if I'm gonna bring a big backpack. Like, I feel like I should, but I also don't really have anything to put in it. <laughs> I don't know, I don't have that much stuff to bring with me on the plane. So we'll see. Anyways, I'm gonna have my call in a bit. But I thought I would update you guys on that so far. And yeah. All right, I just finished my call. It actually went really well. There's some very exciting things coming for Lululemon in the next little bit. But I thought that I would just show you guys what I've packed so far in terms of toiletries. It's gonna be my little bag that I just bring in my carry-on. So I have a facial spray, which is just hydrochlorous acid. I have a mini mouthwash. I have a little bit of makeup, a mini perfume. I think I'm actually gonna put a deodorant in here too. This is supposed to be for liquids, but I'm putting stuff in it that's not really liquids because I just have a lot of stuff that I want to bring. And I have some makeup because I'm gonna go to the airport, obviously not wearing makeup because we're gonna sleep on the plane. But I thought if I wanted to just do like a little bit of a touch up in the morning to make myself feel a bit better, that this would be the way to go. So I have my house ups concealer, a lip liner, an eyebrow gel, and lip balm in there. And then this is my hair bag. So I'm planning to just mainly air dry my hair when I'm there. I just can't be asked to bring stuff. And also like it's a different wattage system. So a lot of my stuff wouldn't even work there. So I'm just gonna air dry and also do some like slick backs and stuff. So I brought this for slick backs. It's the Kristen S Recovery Balm. This stuff is so good. Sorry, my phone's going off. My mother is texting me. This thing is so good. So I've been loving that. And then I just got a mini shampoo and conditioner to bring from Gisu, so I have that. I have my Olaplex oil in here. I have some dry shampoo. 
This is like a anti-frizz thing. I put it in a little travel container. It's from The Way. And I just have a little mini leave-in conditioner again in the travel container. And that's basically it for my hair and then just a brush. There's also a bunch of like hair ties and clips and stuff in here. This is my skincare and makeup bag. So the bottom section is my skincare. This is from Rare Beauty and this is such a great travel bag. Like I'm obsessed with this. So in here I have my skincare. I've already started packing everything. And in here I have my little space drying towels because I don't really use a regular towel ever and some cotton rounds. So again, cleanser I put in here. It's just my La Roche-Posay one, Bioderma mini one for taking off makeup. I'm bringing some castor oil because I mix this into my moisturizer at nighttime and I've been loving that. A bit of like facial mist in here. I'm bringing the Astera Auto Barrier Cream, which is a Korean brand. I'm also gonna bring Secofate from Avene. I'm bringing, and then just some sunscreen. This is the Centella Hyaluronic Sika by Skin1004. And also just some like bronzing drops. I really like these ones. I mix it with my sunscreen sometimes. It's by Salty Face, it's like a liquid bronzer. It just gives you like a little bit of glow on your skin. And that's all of my skincare. And then in the makeup section, I just have like a little bit of extra makeup, like blush, mascara, eyeliner, stuff like that. But this travel bag is just so perfect. I love it. So those are all of my toiletries other than like toothbrush, shaver, all those things I also need to remember. I'm like terrified I'm gonna forget <laughs> to pack them because I'm just a space cadet sometimes. Hopefully I will remember to pack that. But if not, we can always buy stuff. It's not the end of the world. Jay keeps reminding me that Ireland is a fully functioning country where <laughs> I can go to the store and get anything that I need. That's my little toiletries. Run down. One I have so far. Hello everyone, I did not mean to update today, but we we're supposed to be leaving in a couple hours to go to the airport. Fingers crossed everything will be smooth and we'll take off and we'll be heading there. It has been such a shit show of a morning. It was like a torrential downpour, but we had to drive and drop Millie off. So I was really driving in the scariest weather ever. Then Toronto basically flooded. Um, <laughs> when I tell you it's been a morning, I will include a clip so you guys can see the flooding that was going on that we were dealing with downtown. It was insane. But anyways, we're basically all packed now. Our flight was like delayed. Um, at first we thought it was canceled because they sent things saying it was, it was moved till tomorrow, but then they sent another thing saying, no, it's back on and just delayed. So I don't know. We're thinking it's delayed. It's normally it takes 36 minutes to get to the airport. Apparently now it's gonna take an hour and 20 minutes to get to the airport. So it's just gonna be it's been a day, guys, but I hope that you guys enjoy this video. The next one you see for me will be my Ireland vlog. I think I'm gonna miss like one upload because I didn't have enough time with like filming and stuff, but the next thing you see for me will be Ireland stuff. So yeah, love you guys, and I'll see you all in my next video. Bye.